Hello, it is Kelly with Kelly State and Auction Company, and uh, here I am. Here I am. This is uh, typical. We the sale starts tomorrow, and I have just now discovered this wonderful box. It is from Bonnie's Granddaddy's Grocery Store in Stonewall, Georgia, and it is just full of grocery store receipts receipts and this is one of the favorite parts I love about my job this is really great history you look in 1936 you could get a can of oil for 15 cents a can of beer for 20 cents some snuff for 10 cents you can get all that for 45 cents that is amazing can you imagine if we could get those prices today I mean it just shows you the inflation Look at this, cake for 50 cents. The list just goes on and on and on. Apple candy, five cents, five cents. You got two pieces of candy for 10 cents. Flour, 75 cents. Shells, I'm assuming, I don't know, shotgun shells maybe. Blades, 10 cents. Milk, look at that. 12 cents for milk. 1936. That just is a grocery 91. Flour, $1.20. And it just goes on and on. Cheese, 10 cents. Oh my goodness, that cigarettes for 12 cents. And I guess it's really a good thing that we can't get all those really bad things that are bad for us for that cheaper money today. Probably be a lot of sick people around. Anyway, that's just my opinion, but I love looking through all this history, and this whole box will be for sale. And what even is better is the box that's in. Just as interesting, you've got 10 crown activated charcoal for wider teeth. Ha <laughs> ha. And you get Ten sticks and the box is actually advertising mounds candies and I guess my favorite part is their grocery store label Smith's grocery staple and fancy groceries fruits and vegetables Stonewall Georgia ain't that something all right see y'all tomorrow at the sale bye bye